Okay, so I'm at the door going into the basement. Here we have the, the water pump, uh, the header tank for the water pump right here. And there's the door to the basement. Um, so on the right, there's drip rock walls. Again, the basement looks good, smells good. Uh, painted floor. It looks like there might be some peel and stick tiles here. Right there. Um, and this material here, so it's hard to see what's behind it. Uh, lots of insulation in the, in the ceiling here. Uh, good to see the metal posts. That's what you want in a basement. Again, the, the floor joists and the beams. Everything looks good, good and solid. Big open room in here. Look at that nice carpet. Fancy, this is where the fancy dining room is. Okay. <laughs> um, here's the electrical, 100 amp wiring. So, um, yeah, and, oh, and behind this canvas, there's insulation and uh, some sheets here make a nice, good room divider. Uh, here's the washer and dryer. Small freezer. And everything you know needs a good cleaning but besides that everything looks good and again with basements you want to it's good high ceiling too so hats off again to those architects um this is the the work space area little shop down here uh water pump sump pump it's really important and what we have here is something every house should have. Uh, it's um, a backup battery for the water pump. That's interesting. And it looks like there's Bluetooth attached to it as well. Hmm. Yes. Uh, so propane furnace. Forced air, propane forced air furnace. Little convection heater here. Uh, so yeah, this guy's he's got a, some lots of small appliances. I think he's a small appliance repair guy. Uh, so there's your hot water tank right in here. It looks electric. The chimney looks good. Actually, the basement. Basement looks pretty good. No obvious flaws down here. Besides a good cleaning. All right. Let's get these lights. Quick tour again. And there's the entrance. Oops. All right.